Hi everyone, welcome to a, another video here on my craft channel, Crafty Cassie. I am Cassie, and today I have a new kind of craft project that I'm going to be working on long term. So this is going to be part one of a series video. So I follow another art crafter um, who is more specifically a drawing channel, um, Art a la carte, I believe is how you say it. Um, she actually had found a doll room, um, or a miniature doll house, uh, online and had ordered it and was starting to put it together at, through a live stream and had done it a couple of times. Um, I have not seen any updates of that room, but I was really interested in it and so I figured I would look into it. Um, I did order a couple myself. Actually, I think I have like three or four of these, maybe even five. Um, and I've gotten them at different areas. So this one came from Wish.com. It is an uh, an app that you can download onto your phone. And I think I got this one for like maybe $15. I'm not sure. But this is how it came packaged. Um, this is not normal packaging. I don't know why it came packaged like this. Uh, so hopefully all the pieces are in here. But um, let's go ahead and get open, get it open and make sure that it does have all the pieces. So it's this room here. This is a um, a sewing room. And there's pieces. So this is everything that comes in the doll room. Um, so it looks like we've got what's going to be a sewing machine, and there's the little mannequin, a um, bunch of fabrics, twines, florals, ribbons, things of that nature. Oh yeah, I forget this is a lighted. Um, piece. So this is the battery and the switch, the wire, some screws, the actual diode there for the light, and it looks like that might be the light fixture cover. Uh, some fluff and a jar and cork. Some cutouts here, metal and wooden cutouts. Uh, some ooh, tweezers are in here. I'm gonna go ahead and take these out. Wood pieces to build something. Same. Looks like there's uh, pieces for the, the chair in here. Another wooden bit. This looks like it's the actual room itself here. These are all of the paper cutouts. Ooh, it feels gritty. I don't know if you all know this, but I have a, an issue with um, textures, like grittiness. Uh, I don't like sand very much, and this feels like it's got a very fine sand on it. So, and it looks like this is supposed to be a layout of all of the pieces that I got. This is to make boxes and stuff like that. Interesting. Looks like this is going to be a reinforcer for like a ironing board. Looks like posters and books. So there's 
the newspaper. Here's the flooring. Okay, so solid lines. Are for cutting, dotted line is for folding, blue dot line is for folding backward, red dotted frame is for reserved paper. So like this, this is reserved paper. Gray frame is paper pattern which is not used in actual product. Oh actual products. So these are not used in actual products. Interesting. Well, let's pull out the instruction. I do have a box here. Um, it came with like some hot chocolate, I think, and some mugs or something of that nature. We got it for Christmas. And I'm actually going to be keeping all of the pieces in here just to kind of keep it all together so I don't lose it. Things like that. And each of these are labeled. So like this one says two of two. That says it's also group two, but it's two of one. There's two bags for three. This is five. Put six in front of seven. This is nine. I got six as well. And that's eight. I think they're all. Just trying to put these in order, really. Six, five, four, three, and two. is one here. Alright, so let's go ahead and dig in. Alright, so I was supposed to get tweezers, pigment and brush, and scissors. I think that's a misprint here. Um, I do not have scissors, and I don't have a brush either, but that's fine because I've got a brush. But I'll need a ruler, scissors, a utility knife, needles, pliers, a pencil, a clip, a screwdriver, and a needle. Um, I happen to have all of those. Um, mine also came with a little bit of white glue. I'm actually going to be using some Annie's um, Super Tacky Glue when I need to glue things. So, yeah. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and work on that. So we're just going to start from the beginning. It looks like we're going to do the fabric cabinet first. And... It lays out all the pieces that I'm going to need here. Lays out all the pieces I'm going to need here. So, this is what it's going to look like when it's all done. So, it doesn't even have me building the room first. Do I build the room first? I build the room? No, I build the room last. So, you build all the accessories and then you build the room. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. Um...
the finished project. Uh, again, it is only the first furniture item of Lisa's tailor shop. Uh, so it is the shelf here. Nothing's actually moving, but there are nice three slots where I'm going to be filling into the next video. Um, those are actually the next step is to create the fillers. So it looks like we're going to be doing some fabric scraps, uh, some boxes, some pillows. Um, yeah, actually that's a basket. I'm really excited about all of that. So um, yeah, so if you want to see those, definitely hit the subscribe button and that will make it easier for you to find my videos because they will pop up in your subscriptions. Um, but you can also hit that notification bell and it will give you a notification via email or uh, on your YouTube app on your phones um, that you have a new video by me. So um, thumbs up if you like this and want to see more like it. I'm definitely going to be doing more videos like this. Uh, I have quite a few of these little craft kits and I'm super excited to work on them. So until next time guys, bye.